What's up, Facebookers? It's your boy James R. Davis Sr. coming to you live this morning. Happy Tuesday to everybody. Hope everybody's having a phenomenal day. Come on in, come on in, come on in, man. Let me know where you're timing in from. Give me your, give me your city, your state, where you're timing in from, man. Welcome, 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 welcome. Good morning, good morning, good morning. I want to talk to you guys real quick, man. I got a message for you guys this morning. So you might, you guys may want to share this video. Share this video, share this video, man. Welcome, 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 welcome. Welcome, everybody. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Good morning, Phyllis. Good morning, Elaine. Good morning, Rose. Good morning, Marcia. Travis, good morning, good morning. You guys may want to share this video, man. It's going to be sharing some value here. It's not going to be very long at all, but I just wanted to hop on real quick, man. I just, uh, just getting back to the flow of things. Responding to messages and emails and all this good stuff. Waco, Texas in the building. South Carolina in the building. Welcome, welcome. And so hopefully my music is not too loud. Is the music too loud? Can you guys hear me okay? Give me a thumbs up if I can be heard okay. Sharing is now. Thank you. Appreciate that, bro. I'm scared. <laughs> Here's the topic. Here's the caption up above. Y'all see it? So I'm gonna hop right into it, man, real quick, man. Go ahead and like this video if I can be heard okay. Give me a drop a number one if I can be heard okay. Cause I, I'm gonna I'm hop right into it. And you guys know I don't I don't I don't cut corners, man. I speak truth. I speak my mind. I don't really care who who, who gets offended, who who gets hurt by it, all this kind of stuff, man. I just gotta say it, man. I mean, because uh we're all grown people. We're grown people, right? We're all grown. What's up? What's up, CJ? How you doing, bro? Hey Ann. Marcia said. She can hear me okay. It's one. All right, cool, 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 cool. Listen, you know, I, I um, <laughs> I loud and clear. All right, cool, cool. Man, I've been I've been in this industry of of of, of leadership development, helping people uh, stretch themselves, change their lives, change their zip codes. Um, you know, for seventeen years now, for seventeen years. And um, this thing is this thing sliding? Yes, it is. Okay, let me make sure I keep my eye on that. Uh, but anyway, it, it, it just never really ceases to amaze me um, how many people will complain, will, will complain about their situations, right? They'll uh, voice that they're not where they want to be at in life. And all of these different things, I hear all the different things that from, from people, right? From, I, I mean, I've heard it all. I've heard it all. Okay, I've heard it all from people who really want more, who, who, who want to travel more, who want to spend more time with their spouses, who want to spend more time with their children. Um, you know, who think people who just desire things in life. Okay. They desire things in life. Okay. And it's just, it amazes me how many people are actually scared. I just had someone tell me, and I hear this often, and I just wanted to hop on real quick. And I, really, I want to ask you guys a question, man. Why? Like, how, why, why are y'all scared to, to get outside of your comfort zone, to become the best version of yourself? Uh, I mean, listen, guys, we only live once. You know, like, you only got one life. You're not going to come back and try it again next time. Y'all know that's my motto, right? What are y'all scared of? Like, I'm, I'm, I'm blown. I just, I'm blown away. Okay. And, some of you guys know I will put you on the spot, okay? Because I love you. I will put you on the spot because I love you, okay? I want you to do better, okay? And I know people follow me, hundreds and thousands of people are going to see this video, and I'm pretty sure that they're talking to people that, that, that they can relate, okay? And so it's going to help somebody. This video is going to help somebody, man. Listen, I'm not doing this to put people on the spot and talk about them and put them down, okay? I'm not doing that for that reason. I'm doing this to show you guys that I literally deal with this stuff on a day-to-day -day basis all the time. I hear from 30-year-old plus people, 40-year-old plus people, 50-year-old plus people who tell me, and this person is watching right now, welcome. This video is for you. I'm not going to call your name, but this video is for you. I don't get it. How the hell is a grown person scared to improve their financial situation? I don't get that. I don't understand that. How are y'all scared, right? So I'm, I'm gonna read this correspondence, right? I'm gonna read this correspondence. I was gonna show you the screenshot. I'm, I'm not gonna do that. This person knows who I'm talking about because they're watching right now, 
Okay. I, I can't help you guys if you don't, if you're not willing to help yourself. How are you scared? Y'all answer the question. Now answer this question for me, guys. How in the hell is grown people? Grown, build, pan, responsible people. People who've raised children. Like, you've raised children, you can do anything you want in this world. Like, that takes a lot of sacrifice and commitment. How in the hell are you scared to improve your financial situation and live the life of your dreams? I don't understand that. How are you scared to do that? Somebody answer that question for me, please. Because in 17 years of working with people, I get it. I really do get it. I get it. It's, it's conditioning. It's mindset. It's, 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 it's what the subconscious mind has observed and been around for years. It's the environment. It's your friends. It's your family members. It's the names. Mama them. Cousin them. It's radio. It's, it's TV. It's all of the conditioning that we have been, um, have been, unfortunately, <laughs> unfortunately have been enveloped with you know we, we we've allowed our environments we've allowed our associations we've allowed our own thinking to keep us stuck to a point where we're scared to do things that's going to improve our lives i don't understand it like for me you 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 ain't sick and tired of being sick and tired yet if that's you if you if you tell me i'm scared <laughs> to start a business, to 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 adjust your W four and get the money back that the government is taking from you, right? That's that's an issue. That's a real problem, guys. That's a real problem, right? Man, I don't I don't understand it. And you're not even willing to get the right information so you can so you can so you can not be scared. I don't I don't I want to. How the fuck are y'all scared? How you scared, man? I don't get that. You grown. You scared, though, to improve your life. You scared, though, to invest in the business. You scared, though, to follow some simple instructions that'll put more money in your pocket. Uh, what's the problem, folks? How are y'all scared and you grown? How you scared and you grown? How? How? So here's the deal, here's the deal guys. I, I, I got to read this correspondence, man. I got to read this correspondence because it's, just, it's, it's sickening. It's sickening, man. This shit is fucking sickening. It's sickening to see my people willing to be a slave, willing to be stuck, willing to, to struggle, willing to, to live check to check, willing, willingly, willingly, <laughs> like, willingly blows me away. So let me read the correspondence. First of all, I'm going to go all the way back to January 4th, 2019 of this year, when this person requested more information for something that I posted. Sent the person the info, gave the person the price point, gave them the information, gave them the link. Bam. The person didn't say thank you. The person didn't say I appreciate the information. They didn't say nothing, right? Absolutely nothing. So one thing about James R. Davis Sr. that you need, guys need to understand is this. I don't chase people. I replace your ass. I'm not going to chase no damn body. I'm not going to beg nobody to participate in their own rescue. I'm not going to do that. I sort through people. Listen. I, I sort through people all day. All day. So if you, if you this person on this list and you ain't marked off, and you scratching your head and you thinking about it and you praying about it and you talking to your spouse about it and you talking to the names about it and you, and you, you know, whatever your excuse is for not getting started, for not changing your life, for not getting your, 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 your money back in your paycheck. That's yours. It's yours. You scared to get your own damn money? Really? Really? <laughs> Some of y'all are too conditioned to be a fucking slave. Whoever don't like my language, get your ass off this post. Hey, y'all know how it is. Y'all know how I do. It's your boy, man. Yeah, I'm back. I'm back. I ain't going to play with y'all. I'm going to keep it real with you. How the hell are you scared to get your own money back from the government that's taking it from you? How? So the person requested more information. I sent the information. Person did nothing, right? January 5th. 
Person responded again, wanted the same damn information that they asked for the last damn time. Didn't do nothing with it the last time, so they're going to ask for it again. So guess what I do? I give it to the person again. I give the person some proof. I give the person some testimonials. The person do nothing. February 1st. This is the third time. <laughs> I'm like, yo, it's the same info I've been sent. Let me let me show you this. So y'all think I ain't so y'all see I ain't bullshitting with you. No, hey, look, man. I don't care about putting this person on the spot. They need to see this. Look, look, February 1st, y'all see it. Yo, I've sent the same info. It's the same info I've sent. Okay? So <laughs> So I'm, I'm trying to be nice. I'm trying to be nice. I'm giving you the information again, okay? Give it to you again, no problem, right? Do a little video. Get Look, look, I don't want y'all figuring out nothing. Look, I try to keep things so simple for you guys. Do a little video to walk you through it, a little one minute video to walk you through it, right? This person said, damn, I'm sorry, boo, working too hard, too much over here. Uh, how, how, how you liking that? How you liking that? You working too hard, too much over here. How you liking that? How does it make you feel? So work, 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 work. Ain't never got time for shit. Work and you broke? How the hell you busy and you broke? That don't even, that don't even, that don't even make sense. Y'all busy and broke? Really? <laughs> That's crazy. Let me keep it moving. Let me keep going. Let me keep going. Let me keep going. No problem. You got the information, it's all that matters. This is how I responded. Thank you and congratulations. Okay, you're welcome. I don't know what she congratulated me for, whatever, right? So, February 26th. February 26th. So, you're serious about taking action or not? Like, come on, man. What the fuck is wrong with y'all out here? Let me keep, let me keep going. Let me keep going. Let me keep going. The person said, yes, I am. Okay. I said, okay, we will see. Let's go. Let me show you. Let me show you, man. <laughs> let me show you, man. Like, like, yes, I am. Okay. We will see. Let's go. Person still ain't did nothing yet. Still ain't did shit yet. Let me keep it moving. And some of y'all think I'm mad. I ain't mad. I'm laughing like a motherfucker at y'all stupid asses out here because listen, man. Listen, man, listen, listen. You can't push a fucking rope. And you can't push a rope, guys. I'm not gonna try to push a fucking rope. I'm gonna lead you to the water. I may throw some Kool-Aid in the water and make it a little sweet for you even. But if you don't drink the goddamn water, man, look, I can't do shit about that. You know what I'm saying? I can't help you. Let me keep it moving. Person says I'm listening. I'm like, okay, cool. So we still corresponding back and forth. All right, now this morning at 9.55 a.m. Let's go to this morning. The reason for this video, okay? So first of all, I need you new followers to understand something about James R. Davis Sr. Don't fucking waste my time. Stop fucking playing with me. Stop playing with you. Stop wasting your goddamn time, okay? Don't waste my time. Because that's the quickest way to get your ass blocked and deleted and get you completely out of the blessing circle. You're going to get complete pushed completely out of the blessing circle. We are a blessing. I'm a blessing. People get paid fucking with me. People retire working with me. People making 20, 30, 40,000, 50,000 a month working with me. While you bullshitting and playing and being busy and fucking broke. Let me keep it moving. This is just my passion, guys. This ain't me mad. This is my passion. This is how I speak on my goddamn timeline. So whoever got a problem with it, again, get your ass up on my shit. Just keeping it real with you, okay? I don't do this all the time. It's rare that I use this kind of profanity, but this is the only way some of you motherfuckers gonna understand. I, I gotta get in your shit for you to understand, grown fucking people. Now let me show you this dumb shit. Let me show you this dumb shit that this person told me, man. Let me show you this dumb shit that this person told me. Right? This is this is insane to me. Like you can't be sick and tired of being sick and tired. I've got to send you this shit three and four and five goddamn times. Are you serious? Stop coming on my shit. Damn. Stop coming on my shit. If you ain't serious. 
I don't need you motherfuckers in my business. I'm here to help. Check my fucking track record. Y'all see all these goddamn comments on this post? These people are winning over here, man. Whether they in my business or whether they in network marketing or not, the people's lives I've been able to impact, they ain't got no goddamn jobs. They living the life of their dreams while y'all bullshitting. For real? Let me show you this shit, man. <laughs> <laughs> Let me show you this bullshit, man. This shit crazy. I'm scared. Dude. Get the fuck out of here with that dumb shit. Really? Man. <laughs> Let me show y'all this shit, man. I swear to God. Well, I can't make this shit up, man. I can't make it up. Check this out. Watch this here. This person commented on a post from last year that I brought back up in my feed, right? So here's my response. Hey, I got your message. Now I already rolled up and looked at the previous conversations before I even sent her this shit right here, right? Miss Teresa Jones, yeah, I'm talking about you. I said I wasn't gonna put you on the spot, but yeah, I gotta put your ass on the spot. Your ass probably from Memphis. Let me check and see. Most motherfuckers from Memphis do this dumb shit. Let me see where she from. I guarantee you her ass is from Memphis. <laughs> I wouldn't fucking doubt it. I, it, it, does, it doesn't say. She probably gonna be hot and mad and pissed off and you know all of her feelings and all. I don't know. San Antonio, San Antonio, Texas. You in San Antonio, Texas? You in San Antonio, Texas? Oh my freaking god, man! And you right there where the fire is at, and you won't even take action, man. Let me show y'all this. Let me show y'all this. Let me show y'all this. Let me show y'all. Let me show. I know you is over there laughing your ass off. Oh my God. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Look, man, I don't fuck around. I don't play with y'all asses on Facebook, man. Look, man, it's crazy because when I deal with people offline, personally, face to face, not social media shit, people rocking with me, man. Y'all ass on social media. Y'all so fucking fake and phony and with the bullshit on social media, man. I swear. I'm living my best life. No, the fuck you ain't living your best life. You living your best life. You motherfuckers is slaves out here, man. How the fuck you gonna let people dictate your whole goddamn life? Your whole life? You still living for paycheck to paycheck and you in your 40s and your 50s and your 60s? You ain't figured this shit out yet? Let me get to it. Let me show you this shit. I ain't making this shit up. Let me show you. Let me show you this, man. This is crazy. Look. Got your message. I have a question for you. Why won't you just take action on the information I keep sending you that you keep asking for? Never got this one. Scroll up. You'll see I've sent it. First time I ain't never got this one. Shit, bullshit. You <laughs> so again, why not just take action? Okay, that doesn't answer my question. LOL, why? This motherfucker said scared. You see this shit? You see this shit? <laughs> Woo! So the truth comes out. You motherfuckers is scared. Really? Scared of what? What y'all scared of? What? What you scared of, man? Somebody tell me what the hell y'all scared of out here. You know what you need to be scared of? Staying stuck, staying broke, passing that fucked up mentality on your kids so they can deal with the same broke, dumb shit that you've been dealing with. That's what you need to be scared of. You need to be scared that the United States dollar, this economy is about to fucking crash and you motherfuckers gonna be over here fucked up, not even knowing what the fuck going on. Because you got your goddamn hair you're saying and you've been a goddamn slave to a time clock. Every fucking day. Work, 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 work. Broke, 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 broke. But you're scared. You're scared to change your situation. How? How the fuck y'all scared to change your situation, man? You ought to be more scared to stay in the same goddamn situation you in. Jesus Christ. Man, y'all gotta stop this bullshit. You got to the end of the fucking year to work with me. I keep telling you guys that. After next year, I don't want to hear no motherfucking, I want to work from home, James. What's the link, James? Can you help? No. I 
2019 is a wrap. I'm done dealing with y'all, man. Period. Because you motherfuckers don't want it like you say you do, man. You don't want it. You don't want it. <laughs> I work with the people that want it. I don't work with you motherfuckers that don't want it. So here's a, here, I'm asking you a favor. Can y'all please stay on my post? When I post shit like who want to make some money from home for the rest of this year and you done ask for the same fucking shit 15, 20 goddamn times, stay off my shit. Because you don't even understand. You a fucking slave and you don't even realize you a slave. You scared. Fuck you mean you scared. Man, please. <laughs> How, Sway? How? Ugh. Some of y'all get under my skin with that bullshit. Big grown ass, scared. <laughs> we got people over here making fifteen, twenty thousand dollars a week. She, but you scared them. You scared. You scared though. Wow, man. Wow. Okay. Hey, scared money don't make no money, folks. I can't help you. So here's the rest of the, the respondents. So let me, let me, let me, I can't make this up, guys. I can't make this shit up, man. So you scared to get your own money? Stop laughing. Okay, carry on, my sister. Talk about some, no, she ain't scared to get her own money. You ain't fucking moved yet. You ain't took action yet. They still taking your shit. They still taking it. So I sent the person a screenshot of when she first asked for it. Sent another screenshot. And I just told the person, look, I can't help people who refuse to help themselves enjoy your day. And I just sent this one last time to this person. You need to seriously stop what you're doing and look at this. Or else you'll stay stuck right where you are. I won't be sharing this again. You're obviously not serious the person seen it didn't respond i'm pretty sure she's all in her feelings right now you know i don't give a fuck about you being in your feelings right now it don't matter you still stuck you still st you still letting the government take your shit you still giving the government an interest-free loan y'all still getting refunds out here like that like you bowling Travis, right, man, it was $20 back in January. You could have got involved with 